Hey guys, my name is Kip and in this video I'm going to teach you how to move your Valorant installation folder from one driver to another one. I see some of the players that when they want to uh, move their Valorant installation file from uh, one driver to another, they uninstall the game and uh, install it again, which is one of the ways, but this way that I'm going to show you doesn't require any downloading and it's super easy. You just move the file of Valorant from where you install it to the uh, driver that uh, you want it to be there. Make sure to follow my steps, al although it's easy, but there are some small tricks that you should know, uh, otherwise it won't work out. Let's not waste time and head right into the tutorial. Okay guys, first of all, uh, what you need to do is to uh, open Riot Client. You simply type Riot Client in the search bar. Here it is, just open it. We wait for the application to open up. There it is, Riot Client, Riot Games. Then uh, click on Valorant right here. We click on Valorant. On top right corner, there is this human icon. Just click on it, come down and uh, you can see settings. Click on the settings. And then uh, we can see install pass. This is where your Valorant is installed. For yours could be different. For mine is C, Valorant, Riot Games, Valorant, then slash live, okay? Now we know where our Valorant is installed. Now what we have to do is to uh, close this tab, uh, go to this PC, go to the pass that your uh, Valorant is installed. For me it was C, so I'm going to game folder, C, Valorant, uh, Riot Games, and Valorant, right here. So, all you have to do right now is to just click on Valorant, right click on it, press cut, then go to the driver that you want to install the game on. Um, for me, it's going to be E on my games driver, for you can be any driver you want. Then once you went to the driver, just right click and paste or control V to paste. And this bar should come up. Well, obviously it takes time, like downloading the game. I'm going to pause the video and when it's finished, uh, we are going to continue the video. 99 and 100, come on. Come on, 100, yeah. Okay, we've done it. Now, as you can see, Valorant folder is in my E drive, my games drive. Uh, Valorant, yeah, it's right here, live. Yeah, Valorant is right here. Now, all we have to do is to uh, open, well, open Riot Client if you closed it, open it again, and you should click on play. And when you click on play, uh, it will show you that Valorant failed to launch. Uh, it will show an error, just press OK. You should see an install button right here. Click on it, and then well, obviously, we don't want to download the game because we already have the files. So, under this install button, you can see already installed. So, yeah, we already have the Valorant folder. So, just click on all already installed. And go to the drive that you moved the folder to. For me, it was my E drive. Let's find Valorant. Where is it? Valorant, yeah. So... Open Valorant, open live, and then click OK. You should click, you should open live and then click OK. Now, OK. And as you can see, the install button turned into play button. And that's it. We successfully moved the Valorant installation folder from one driver to another. However, the big question is that does the game work? Let's find out. So I'm going to click on play. Yeah, as you can see, I guess the game is launching. We just wait for the game to launch. Here we go, guys. As you can see, the game works completely fine. Let's go on to the menu. Yeah, it's completely fine. We can see everything right here. Let's go to the store. As you can see, everything is set and ready to play. That's it for today's video, guys. Thank you so much for watching up until here. Make sure to drop a like 
and subscribe my channel for more videos like this in future. Once again, my name is Kip and I hope that this video helped you out. See you in the next video.